Attention, everyone. <clears throat> quack, 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 said Mrs. Quackenbush. A story by Anne Frank. Go ahead, Anne. We're all listening. Once upon a time, there was a mother duck and three beautiful ducklings who lived in a lake ruled by a proud swan. Quack, 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 said Mrs. Quackenbush to her brood. Quack, 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 said the ducklings. Keep your voices down, roared the swan, his feathers all in a ruffle. Be quiet, or I'll bite you, and then you'll never quack again. This one was not a nice swan. He was, he was a, a black swan. And all the other ducks in the lake were afraid of him. But not Mrs. Quackenbush. You won't bite these children, she said to the swan, who answered, I'll do exactly what I please. They're only ugly little ducklings, and I am their master. And then he began to bite the ducklings. Save us, Mama! The poor little ducklings cried. And then Mrs. Quackenbush began to quack. She quacked, and she quacked, and she quacked. Stop it! Stop that infernal quacking, cried the swan, putting his wings over his ears. But Mrs. Quackenbush did not stop. Not until the black swan flew away, never to return. She gathered her ducklings around her, and together they swam off happily ever after, singing, quack.